All right, what's up, y'all? As y'all can see, I just got done editing this motherfucker. It took like what, like 40 minutes? You know what I'm saying? It took like what, like probably like 15 minutes recording the video. So it usually take me the hour to make the video. But um, I want to start off this video by saying shout out to Will and Madam Marie for making this shit happen. Um, like I'm not trying to make it seem like this is the biggest place in the world, but obviously K Swap is a good artist, so shout out to him. Um, obviously every sound in this beat is ours. Um, I can show y'all what sounds we use. Um, obviously the secret 808 that y'all all want within that mother. And we not giving that away, okay? Unless D dot will say he wanna get that away, we not giving that away. I just wanna repeat that so that ain't away y'all probably never gonna get that. Um, but <laughs> that snare, that snare that did I use in that beat is called um SBR 12 2. That snare is in the speed trap kit and it is in the glick god kit, okay? And the link is in the description as y'all know. My kits are 70% off right now, so y'all need, need to go fuck with that. Um, the link is in the car and the description. The hi hat is in John Glick 2, as y'all can see. Um, in the tetralogy, we have the glick Owens hi hat. Um, um the glick Owens hi hat is in that kit, and I think he used use the the goat brian james but i'm sure he's gonna have his own video where he breaks that uh where him and manda probably break that beat down but yeah um shout out to triple beam shout out to everybody who makes me great man shout out to y'all yeah i pretty much don't know what else to fucking say let's get it man but what's up y'all it's your boy right this video is sponsored by not this plan fucking i ain't gonna lie i love keeping taking a break because i just been overwhelmed with shit like ever since i went through that one shit i went through that i told y'all about i think i said something on my live and then i made a video about it but i don't really feel like talking about it Long story short, this family shit. You feel me? Um, I appreciate y'all having my back and supporting me through this whole thing, bro. A lot happened in the past, like, month. I just been moving, family stuff or whatever. And it's just been a lot. So I ain't really been, like, I've been consistent, but it's been hard for me to do things at the right time. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know how to explain that but it just has been um my brain this ain't been in the right spot bro and i had to give myself some time to get myself back together because man bro like being an independent producer it is hard and sometimes it's easy to lose motivation when you get in the spot i can do this man. i can't do everything you know what i'm saying but let's talk about this case swab record bro as y'all know like i cooked up this loop on live it was july 10th this year um i posted it like you know what i'm saying like i was proud of it like like I didn't get the recognition I thought I was gonna get. I'm not supposed to that, but that's okay. You know what I'm saying? I did it from scratch, like I do most of my stuff from scratch. I don't really use loops like that. Y'all know I do. I'm Die like, already, um, nigga. I have to lower a few sounds back in here because I made a beat out of this first, and I had my hard drive, my hard drive stopped working, and so I haven't used it since. But luckily, a lot of the kits that I needed, I went back and I got them. But there's other 808s that I don't have. You know what I'm saying? Like this one. Like I have to, I have to look for. A a lot of these sounds some of them are different now because i've changed the way they sound Ooh, so now that i'm really actually looking at this shit it's actually kind of crazy i use only one vst cooking up this well one other vst simpson but i only use fl plugins for this melody okay that's number one because i was only i think i either did a video or i was live and i cooked up this beat and i was like i only want to use one vst and i ended up using like one other one triple beam stay on the block As y'all can see, I took this melody, right? And I stemmed it out. Usually what I would do is I would take every drum that I've used, I would take it out, right? I would leave it at 56 bars, highlight everything that I don't need. Then I would go like this, put all of the stems in here as so, you know, y'all see it. You know what I'm saying? Um, y'all know I always stem my melodies out. I use Sim Synth with this sound. D Dot and Amanda when they um when they produce this together they 
Either one of them, I don't know who, but they pissed it down. One. Everything else is literally sorry. Get to this next sound right here. I know that's weird, but I think what I did with that is however I recorded it, it just came out like that. And I was just moving the MIDI around in the piano roll to try to see what I could get. It, that, that's what it sounds like <laughs> because I would never like actually put that down. No, but I kept it because it was dope. Let's get to the next sound. So that's the lead right there. Got that joint. A string. I kept that for the whole thing, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can see the preset that I use in SimSynth right here, so I don't, I don't really have to break that down. But let's go through all of the sounds that I used in SAR, so you guys can get a better idea. Um, This is called MC80. Um, This little joint I did right here. This joint in SAR right here is called MC7. This right here, SAR number three, FG Misbehave. And then we go right here. FG four bits is this sound. Oh, that's that. That's that joint. And then um, we go right here to five. Iron banjo. And we go right here to six. And then it's iron moves. You know what I'm saying? I guess it's a string. And that's pretty much it. All together, pitched down, it pretty much sounds like this. Oh lord. <laughs> oh, oh, oh god. Very easy, very simple. Y'all know how I get, man. Y'all know how I am. Like, um, this is proof to all of YouTube producers and shit that be doing all that overcomplicated shit with y'all melodies. Y'all really don't need all that to make a good melody. Like me, I'm just try. I try to be laid back and chill. If I see a sound in the VST that I know I can mod or something and that I like, I just do that. You know what I'm saying? But what's crazy is I think I actually I sent this beat to Uno and um, I don't think he used it, but you know that's why I try to persuade y'all to make y'all beats from scratch and take the melodies that y'all make from that beat and put it in your weekly because if you do that then you will get more opportunities and something will happen that you never thought would happen you know what i'm saying um so just keep pitching y'all stuff out there i know for me it's hard being independent uh because don't nobody like my ass but i really don't give a fuck man have fun do music if you don't then that's it people not gonna like you people gonna talk shit behind your back that's cool you just have to learn to be strong it's gonna be shady people and hee hee ha ha and shit no who cares make good music don't fuck make good music don't focus on that shit man just be yourself um you don't have to watch all of these fucking robot youtube tutorials everybody be all doing this extra shit and whatever bro express your damn self you can use you can use this everything that i just did you can use fucking nexus omnisphere or anything else you can use man um so just be yourself have fun stay motivated man um i appreciate y'all for watching this video it was fun breaking this shit down for y'all um you know what i'm saying as y'all see I, I made this shit wherever i made it it was july 10th um i'm about to link the video at the end uh towards like right now almost at the end so that y'all can see how i actually made it um so whenever that was <laughs> it said july 10th so i'm gonna link it in so um go watch that live of that video to see me actually make the beat john glick 5 is on the way i'm literally halfway done with it i got some 808s and stuff right here <laughs> oh shit y'all can't really see the sound waves so let me change my thing 
you know, some new speed, trap 808s, or spins, venom. Um, I changed the harmonic to the spins, just in case y'all niggas think I'm not actually trying to go in and do some creative shit. I use the secret BSC to do that. That's all I'm gonna preview for now. I'm not gonna preview nothing else. You're in for a treat because all of my kits are 70% off right now. I'm doing another deal, sell, little thingy. Um, like I'm literally, this is the only thing I do. Uh, I go live and I try to inspire y'all. Make sure y'all inspire. I do beat reviews. I'm trying to keep it active, keep the community active, man. Keep y'all motivated, keep y'all inspired. And uh, I try to make my sounds cheap so that y'all could be better producers at a high level for an unbeatable price, okay? Make sure y'all tap in to the email list because the people on the email list are first to know and then i post it on my instagram story and everywhere else if i feel like it but the email list is where i post my sales and i usually do them one to three times a month depending on how you guys um are active with that so go fuck with that man meantime shout out to everybody who makes me great and we out this motherfucking man glick gang i hate go for real yeah yeah ain't, ain't, ain't no way out bitch Ain't no way out. Ain't no, ain't no way out. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Oh my. Oh my God. That's ho man. That's some whole shit, bro. Nah, man. That's no. some whole shit, bro.